What's going on guys? Gadgets123 here. We are back. Thanks again for the like, subscriptions, thumbs up, all the things you guys have been doing for us, this channel, on the road to 200 subs. You can see Bart Simpson right here. As you can see, he's smiling. <laughs> that's, the, that's the best Bart Simpson drawing I could do. Unfortunately, I'm not a good picture drawer, as you could see. Anyways, let's get started. Um, we're going to do a little unboxing of an item I found. And actually, there's really not a lot of reviews that I've seen, especially on Amazon. Amazon usually has a lot of reviews on most of the items, especially if you're looking for an item. There, There's a lot of people that review and post in Amazon. Um, this one only had like one review. They gave it five star, which is good. The problem is that um, it's hard to just get an idea of how good the product is with only one review. And it's kind of weird cause, because it's a Scosche, um mount so let's check it out it is the magic mount pro vent charge let me start again <laughs> magic mount pro charge vent it's a wireless fast charging magnetic mount okay a lot of people like the magnetic mount this one has the added bonus of the qi charger for most of the phones available nowadays all right so let's check it out see what it comes so let's go over the back real quick it, ha it has fast charge Charges provides wireless chargers at your service's fastest possible rate, okay? 360 degrees adjustable design, uh, makes sense. Uh, powerful rare earth magnets are 100% device safe, okay? So that, um, they always um, have some pretty good magnets. And uh, again, it's they kind of repeat it and they say they're the number one mount brand in North America, which they actually are. A lot of people love these Koch model brands. All right, so let's get started. Let's open it up to save some time. I opened it up and I didn't take it out of the actual plastic case, but I just took it out of the box to kind of save some time on this. Let's just put it there, go here. Okay, so again, you get the instruction manual with warranty. Let's put that on the side and let's get started with what you get. Okay, so here is the actual mount itself the this is the, the the face part of the mount um let me kind of show you this is an iphone x okay so if i put the mount right on top of the iphone x it's about half the size of the iphone x so you could get an idea how big this the head of the mount is on this specific model all right so let's just put that on the side all right you also get Okay, so you also get the actual part that goes in the vent itself. The uh, it's made of rubber and it's pretty. It's really hard to open, which is the way it's supposed to be. Especially if it's gonna go in the vent, it needs to be pretty hard in order to kind of hold the mount in place. So let's just put it in there, and that's it. That's how it works. Okay, so that's one piece. So it has a pretty I, I believe overall really good cable it's thick and it seems like it's not in the cheap brand cables I usually see those on more of the generic you get either a really small um, USB cable or it's just a really cheap like it feels really cheap to the touch this one feels actually pretty good it's probably about six feet with a 90 degree angle on the head of the charging for the mount itself so that's pretty cool you get a car charger it's a standard one it is a scotch model car charger it's one of the smaller ones i kind of like the bigger ones but again if it works and scotch makes pretty decent accessories should shouldn't have any problems you get also oops let me just move that that's the move this out of the way here okay you get three Thing just fell off. Move that, move that. You get three magnetic plates, okay, which is actually pretty cool. Normally, you get just two pieces. You get the first magnetic plate, which is a full actual bar. Um, this usually goes on the f in back of a lot of the phones, but this mostly is used on phones that don't have QI chargers because this blocks the QI charging. When you like, it, for instance, if you put this on this phone and you try to charge it with the mount itself, you won't be able to get a charge on it because the magnet blocks the QI charging from the device. So this is 
This actual uh, plate magnet usually goes on phones that don't have QI chargers because if you if it doesn't have a QI charger then you don't need to charge it on that device so it's kind of pointless to put these little ones. This one is the standard one you get on most of the um, magnetic mounts with QI chargers. You get two pieces that you could put on the phone so it doesn't block the QI charging and it lets it charge while still mount, mounted on the device. And this is an actual something new that comes with this package. It's a Galaxy S9 and S9 Plus template. So basically you're getting the two magnets that usually are universal. But these ones are made specifically for the S9 and S9 Plus. Because as you can see the bottom part is standard. The top part has this, this little kind of L J shape design. Just because of the camera when you put it on the phone itself. It doesn't cover the camera of the S9 that usually goes right about there. So they kind of made it this way for most of the people that have the S9. So that's a little nice extra added bonus. If you have an S9, you get that magnetic template, which is actually cool. All right. So this is what comes in this package. This um, set usually goes for about... And Amazon is going for about 59 $59. What am I doing percentage? Jesus. <laughs> I'm out of it today, guys. There you go. 59 bucks. So it usually goes for about $59 in Amazon right now. It has a four five-star rating. Again, it's only from one person that reviewed it. But as you know, um, Scotch, uh devices and mounts are actually pretty good overall. All right. So this is what comes. If you're interested, I linked the item in the description. What I'm going to do now is we're going to test it out. I'm going to put it in the car. We're going to drive around a little bit and see how that works. And um, if you like this device, then definitely check it out. Again, it's Amazon. If you have Prime, you're good to go. So we're going to see what uh, how this works. All right, guys. So um, one more thing before we get started with the actual testing. Um, one way to kind of help you put these little magnets so it doesn't block the QI charging is basically you take out the, these little magnets out of the... Um, you know, you take the little tape out from it, and then you actually place them right on top and at the bottom, in between the circle with, where is the actual QI charging part. So you basically just put it right there. Ah, it's a pretty strong magnet here, like right about there, and then the bottom one right in the center as well. Just push it up a little bit. And you try to center it as much as possible, just so it could be kind of centered on your phone, okay? Okay, so, and then what you do is you actually grab the phone that you're planning on using, and you want to center right in the middle so the uh, actual, like, the little sticks, the little magnets kind of stay right in the middle of the phone. So, what we'll do is we'll put it right about there. I think that's perfect. Okay, so you just push it, you push both sides just so the the adhesive could hold the um, magnet in on the phone and get and takes it out of the actual mount. And then we just try to pull it out and there you go. So what's going to happen is now the two magnets are going to be on the actual phone. So there you go. It's going to stick and it's going to be able to charge via the QI charging. So that's a little, little uh, trick that... Uh, it's easy for you guys to remember and to do just instead of kind of aligning it here and then trying to figure out where it's going to be to charge it just place it here remove the little tapes and then just put it on the phone kind of make sure it kind of glues together and then just pull out the actual mount and the actual two adhesive will make the uh, magnet stick in the right positions and uh, you'll be able to charge the phones without actually peeling it out so many times and then getting it you know um, loose in the process all right, so we're going to go test it out and see how this works. All right, guys, we're back. Um, let me put this back and drive. Okay. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm parking. <laughs> All right, so we're going to test it out. We're going to test it out on an actual uh, Galaxy S6 Plus. It's, so it's one of the bigger phones. So it kind of, if you have, for instance, a iPhone 6, 7, 8 Plus, basically the same size, even the Galaxy uh, S8 Plus or Note and so forth. So this is kind of similar to that 
I, I wanted to use it on a bigger phone just to test out the magnet and see how they work. Now keep in mind, hopefully you did the little trick I showed you where you you put first the magnets on top and at the bottom and then you remove the sticky part and then you actually place the phone right on the mount and then remove it so the, the magnets could stay further apart and they could let you charge it via the QI charger. Only if you have a QI uh, charging phone. If you have one of the older models, you don't need this. You'll be using the big uh, magnet, the, the the bar magnet that, that is completely covers the whole back, which is a lot better. The only reason we're using this is because we wanna make sure that it charges, all right? So we're gonna place it on the mount and see if it just, sometimes you have to move it around just because we wanna see if it actual charges, you know, the, the, the QI charging on a lot of these magnetic or regular mounts, you kind of have to play around and see where the actual QI is on these on different model phones. Some of them are higher up, some of them are in the middle, some of them in the lower, lower parts. You kind of have to play around and see until you get it right. Once you get it right, um, you're going to get used to just putting it that way most of the time. All right, so we're going to place it here and see if it charges. There you go. Perfect. So it's charging right now as we speak. So let's go ahead and do a little driving. And again, guys, um, if you like this video, please like, comment, subscribe. I'm trying to do more videos. Uh, man, today's nasty. Today's like raining bad. But um, I wanted to kind of show you this just because I, I needed to post a video already. I've been, I've been not, I haven't had time to post too many videos. And uh, so far it's good. It's actually, th those two little magnets are pretty solid. I do like how those two magnets work. Let me just try to move this around. There we go. Let's see if it's still charging. And it's still charging. Okay, great. So remember, it's a 360 degrees uh, mount. So you could rotate it uh, landscape mode or just regular mode. Um, depending on what you want, but again, as you can see, I don't know if you could kind of, because I'm kind of trying to hit these bumps here, it is charging, so the charging does work, which is actually really good, just got to make sure those, don't play around with those uh, little ma sticky uh, magnets that go on, on, if you, especially if you're using a QI charger, because the more you take it, you take out those little magnets, the more the sticky part is going to kind of wear off, and then um, the, the magnets, like the, the mount is so strong that it's going to hold the magnets instead of holding it on the phone. So you might have to put, uh, especially if you're using, most people are going to be using um, um, cases. You might want to put, if you if you kept taking it off and, and putting it back on and, and you see it peeling off constantly, you might want to go and put some, um, let me just turn this around real quick and see. Okay. You might want to put some probably maybe a little bit of glue on it maybe a little bit of crazy glue on it I know that's gonna mess up your case but regardless it's gonna leave some sort of mark with the sticky part without the sticky part um, so if you don't want that thing to keep falling off and you have a case just put a little bit of glue before you put uh, those little magnets so the um, those little magnets will st will stay in place and they won't be coming out in and out in and out all the time and um, either, you know, you might lose one piece or, you, you know, something happens. If you lose one piece, then you have to buy the set again because you can't have only one little magnet um, in this device or else it's going to keep falling off all the time. So that's just my, my little two cents. Again, if you're interested in, uh, in that, if not, just try not to move it. Oh, my God, it's all flooding in here. Look at that. Um, again, if not, then just try not to peel it out so many times because if you do the uh, sticky part uh, in back of these uh, magnets are going to be running out. All right, so far so good, guys. Um, it is pretty solid. I haven't seen it move. I hit a couple bumps a couple times here. When I press the button, let me see here. Uh, uh, uh. When I press the button, it doesn't, it doesn't move, which is good. So check this out, guys. I'm trying to push it down. I mean, again, I'm not pushing it down super hard, but the magnets are holding it in place. Again, which is good. Overall, I think this device is worth the money, especially if you are looking at the better brand um, magnetic mount. And this one has that built-in QI charger. 
again just make sure that you place those little magnetic uh, mounts in the right place or else it's not gonna charge your phone the way it's supposed to all right guys again uh, that's it for me today in regards to this video I pretty much um, the only person that reviewed it gave it a five star I mean I, I would keep it within five yeah, maybe give me uh, just to be you know not just not to go overboard um, I probably much would give it four stars four out of five overall I think it's a good a good buy just the price a little high I would have liked it to be in like maybe at the 30s not at the 50s but again it's it's if you're looking for something solid uh, it's I think it's worth the money if you like this item just check out the link in the description definitely helps our channel out and um, it helps support this um, channel in regards to you know um, mo uh, it gives us uh, a little bit extra when you guys buy these products online it kind of gives us a percentage um, nothing comes out of your pocket but from Amazon itself and that and and those little contributions help the channel so we could get you know uh, better cameras um, mounts for our videos a lot of people have been saying hey man you should get like a tripod we have a tripod it's just in the car <laughs> I can't use a tripod because um, where am I gonna stand it so I have to kind of hold it one hand dry with the other hand and, and kind of test it out with the other one so uh, need to get a couple more um, accessories just to make it a little bit smoother but overall I think we're trying to give you the best video we can possible all right guys like comment subscribe thanks for everything guys thumbs up appreciate all my subscribers man you guys are great we're on the road to 200 subs two i said again not one 200 subs all right guys thanks again for everything if you like this video comment like and subscribe i'll see you guys in the next video thanks again bye